Hi guys, welcome back to another video with a Rusty Blades YouTube barber. We've got Jamie in chair today, and like always, we're just going to start off. We're going to saturate the hair and we're going to comb it into position and set the foundation for the haircut. So, this haircut is actually just a short back and sides, so he's going to have a number one round the back and sides and then just blend it into the top. We're using the Gamma Boosted today, we've got the number one guard on and we're going to have the lever all the way closed and we're just going to set in the foundation now for the haircut. I don't go too high on the sides, this just gives me more room to work with with the clipper over comb to get it to blend nice. We're working from one side of the head to the other. I always start off on the left hand side of the head. I work setting the, the line, I work around to the back and then I'll switch to the other side and just connect the two together. It just makes it a little bit more even when you're doing that rather than try to work from one side and working all the way around to the other side of the head. When I'm putting this line in as well, when I do go up to the to make the line, I do slightly flick away as well. That just gives it a softer finish. It just makes it easier to blend in as well. We're on to the clipper over comb now. I normally open the lever as well, this just gives you a little bit more security there so you can't take too much hair off and, and make it very harsh. If you see as well, I've got the bottom of the comb and I just lay that against the head and just have it out at a slight angle. This just gives it a nice graduation. Now I've put the one and a half guard on, I've opened the lever and I'm just going to go into where I've done the clipper over comb. This just gets, smooths it off a little bit in case there's any bits that you have missed. By doing the clipper over comb and going into the one and a half guard, we've created a nice square finish. We're going to now go on to the top. I always like to set in a mohawk guideline, but before that, I've just sectioned it off again, and we're just going to do a little bit of scissor over comb, and it just softens that weight above the parietal ridge. Now we're going to set in the Mohawk guideline like I said before, 
we're just going to determine the length which he only wants the ends of it taken off just to tidy it up once we've put in the guideline we're just going to work from front to back on the hair and just make it all level there's no great thrills or spills on this it's just a very basic short back and side <laughs> hair but that most beginner barbers would be able to accomplish so we slightly over direct from the front just to leave a little bit of length in the front of the hair and we're just going to work our way from front to back just following our stationary guideline which is the mohawk section We're going to go in now with the new Stylecraft Instinct Trimmer. We're just going to work around his ears and then just work down his neckline just to tidy that up a little bit. I did actually do an unboxing on this trimmer as well, so I will put a card in the top corner so you can go check that video out if it's something that you like. You can use my code RUSTY15, it'll save you 15%. That's in the US. In the UK, they're not currently available. But I do have a discount code for the Gamma UK as well. So if you're interested in that code, if you go onto Instagram and search me, I will leave a link down below. I will give you the discount code and it'll get you a little bit of a saving as well. When we started this haircut, we did do a number one round the back and side. So I've put the half guard on now. I've opened the lever and we're just going to work into that number one and then gradually work down through the lever until we're down to a zero and then we'll take the guard off as well and just repeat that until it tapers down into his neck. We're coming towards the end of the haircut now. This is always a big must. Once you've finished the haircut and you're taking the gown off, give him a bit of a dust round, get your trimmer back out, clear all those long hairs on the back of the neck, as far as down as you can go. It always makes a difference to the, the people who are sat in there. You don't want to go away with a hairy neck. Trimmer, shaver, a bit of alcohol spray, lemony fresh, 
just gives it a nice little finish. And on that note, I've been Rusty Blade YouTube Barber. Please like, subscribe, and I'll catch you in the next one.